following is a presentation of TFNN. The Money Masters. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Now, Tom O'Brien and Tommy O'Brien. Welcome, folks. Tommy O'Brien, Tom O'Brien. We do appreciate you growling and prowling with us out here. Right now, we have the Dow Industrials up 76. You get the NASDAQ up 31. S&Ps are up 10. We have the gold contract trading down to $13 at 1342 We get silver up $0.09 cents at 2040. The bond market, you get the 10-year note down 12 ticks, the 30-year bond off a point plus 20 ticks at 174.03. King dollar uh, is down 170 ticks at 96.42. Now, King dollar has already rejected lower price here this morning, has dramatically lighter volume. Uh, bottom line, looks like King dollar wants to break topside. We get the euro trading at 110, and the yen is trading at 104. And we have the Dow Industrials two points away from hitting the high. Up again, right? Up and, and a big day yesterday yep. in terms of just holding there and, and showing showing that it wasn't going down, it was going up. No. And we continue, for sure. And what you have out here this morning, so check it out, folks. The the Dow wants to catch up with the S&P. Uh, you've hit 18,349 this morning, 0.76. The high is 18,351.36. 8, <laughs> <laughs> you know, so it, the real... The kicker is, is that is it going to make it? Now I expect it's going to make it. You know, even though it's backed off at this point. It is uh, amazing. We're what 1,300 points off the low after the Brexit. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. Yeah, huge. Um, the NDX 100 uh, and the uh, three Qs. Well, the NDX 100 first, uh, as well as the um, uh, God, three Qs. Uh, I suspect Kevin's still on vacation. That's what's going on. Sorry about this, folks. Okay. Because I was listening to. I was waiting for him. I'm sure other I, people were I, waiting for him. Okay. Thank you, man. No, I appreciate it. Oh, he's ready. Oh, he's ready. Oh, what a beautiful thing there this is. Let's go over to our man, Mr. Kevin Hanks from TD Ameritrade uh, Think or Swim. Shame on me. What are you thinking? He's, uh, the, Kevin Hanks, what's going on? I never go away. Just like a fungus. <laughs> I'm here. Hey, hey, you weren't on yesterday. I was listening to you guys yesterday. Where were you yesterday? You, you were still on vacation yesterday, right? Taking a little break. Yeah, that's uh, right. Perfect. I was too, perfect. man. I, was, I just got back, this too. This is the time to do it, for sure. Uh, that's right. That's they, right. They missed, you know what? they missed you on that show, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Somehow, you know, Tom, it's funny. I traded, I was the specialist in GE for 20 years in that pit. Yeah. And the day that I left the floor to go to the board of trade to start trading, guess what? what? Everything went off just the same. So I don't overestimate my worth in the universe. That's so funny. <laughs> that's my number one rule. That's, that's pretty cool, man. That's pretty yeah. cool. But Tom, there's a song by ACDC that says, that's called Runaway Train. And sometimes I feel like that's what we're on right now. I don't know what's going to stop this market. I'm not sure. But the dollar just might, if it keeps going. Um, you know, there's no doubt. I mean, you got the S&P right now. So the cash S&P took out the cash yesterday. Now, now we get it, you know, you, the further you get away from, you know, the top of that range, uh, you know, we, you're 14 bucks away from it now, which is a good way away from it. The Dow is only two points away from it. I'm figuring the Dow is going to whack that baby today. I mean, you know, you get that close. And we'll see whether the NASDAQ or the NDX can do anything. You know, the, the, there's no doubt that, the, you know, those, those, those are weak, man. Do you know what I mean? So, Yeah, I, I don't know about you, Tom. You've been in this business a long time. Have you ever felt less? positive about an all-time high in my life. I don't think I ever have. No, no, I, I agree. When I, when I'm, no, I, I agree. And what I'm trying to do is keep even my common emotions out of it. Do you know what I mean? I'm saying to myself, okay, exactly. hold it. You know, the Dow, the Dow is at all-time highs. The S&P is. We know that they keep printing money, and I'm saying to myself, okay, well, the NASDAQ hasn't caught up and we know that the NASDAQ likes to lead in the way up and the way down, man. I mean, that's the baby, you know what I mean? So it's like, okay, what's wrong? But then when I look at all the free money, I'm saying to myself, well, the free money's going to go somewhere. You know what I mean? It's like, wow, man. It's so, oh, absolutely. They, they are chasing yield anywhere they can get it. Yeah. That scares me. That scares me because I, I, I just have this feeling we're in a bubble, and we need to be really careful up at these levels. 
Well, but I think I that won't stop you from trading. That's no, for sure. <laughs> well, no, that you know that's what's so cool for what we do. Yeah. Because the bottom line, I mean, I. It's hard for me to understand the long-term investors really in the marketplace. That, that's, that's my bottom line because, like, working hard for your money and then it's just at a time like this, like, oh, my God, you know, if you get another five or ten years, great. Do you know what I mean? Keep it in the S&P. But if you don't, guess what, man? <laughs> you know, so trading is different. There's, you know, and that's why, of course, oh, we yeah, use, yeah. yeah, you know. I remember telling a team of traders, you know, if we're not sure, if we're not committed, stay one trade away from being flat. Yeah. Right. Yeah. One trade. So, you, so if it turns, you can get flat quickly. Right. And and turn on this turn with this market. And if I was talking to a group of traders today, that's exactly what I'd be saying. Stay one trade away from flat. Oh, listen, man. You should have seen me this morning, Kevin. I'm I'm sent, ready to send Tommy the newsletter, and I want to pull the trigger, but I'm saying to myself, you know what? This Dow wants to get into the high and if it gets into the high and gets over that high that will if it gets over this high like 50 or 70 you want points, to pull the trigger and go short go okay. short yeah it'll go 300 it's not going to just go 50 you know what i mean it's either going to test right. it and fail or if it goes 50 man it can go 300 you know yeah. it's, it's one of those deals that you know everyone's shotting it at the high i mean all of us probably but but then we have to close it out again do you know what i mean so yeah just remember that that old saying these markets will go a little further then you can. Then you think they'll go for a little longer than well, you think they'll go. I, and, and, and it's so cool. Once you understand that, man, you just, you just you basically yeah, just you have walk to realize that's what ha that's what can happen. You do, Kevin. We look forward to the show at noon. Can't wait, guys. Have a good day. Have a great one, man. Have a safe one. Stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back. Larry Pesavento has just started his brand new service, Fibonacci 24-7, and he's already delivering content to his subscribers on a daily basis when the market's opened and even on weekends. Each Monday, you'll receive Larry's written report that provides detailed commentary and a summary on the charts and videos that Larry sends out. And throughout the week, when warranted, Larry will send out via charts or videos or both the key markets that he is watching during the day. This will be up-to-the-date active trading information that will Will help you in your daily trading. In Larry's first week alone, he sent out 25 charts, six videos, and a full report to his subscribers in just one week. If you're a technical trader that uses patterns and retracements to trade, then Larry's service Fibonacci 24-7 is something that you must try. Right now, new subscribers can get a full 30-day money-back guarantee. With nothing to risk, sign up now to Larry Pesavento's Fibonacci 24-7 by visiting the front page of TFNN.com under Trading Newsletters. Platinum, grains, crude oil, gold, copper, cattle, hogs, gasoline, natural gas, coffee, cotton, cocoa, and sugar. These are just some of the commodities mentioned in the most recent issue of Andy Hecht's Techno Mental Commodity Report. Andy publishes his weekly newsletter every Thursday morning, where he breaks down the commodity market and provides his subscribers with specific trading recommendations based on his trading methodology. By signing up for a free trial to the Technomental Commodity Report, you'll get a full 30 days to try out this powerful newsletter service and see for yourself the types of trades Andy has recommended for his subscribers. When you sign up for a 30-day free trial, you're under no obligation to pay anything. And should you decide to continue, you will lock in the low rate of only $79 a month. Sign up right now for the Technomental Commodity Report and make sure you're ready to catch the next big trade in commodities. For more information and to get started today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. You know what's cool? Taking something that's good for you. Something specifically formulated to help with weight loss, better sleep, stress reduction, and the need to detox. Nico, our hunter and gatherer ancestors found all their nutritional requirements for health in their wild environment. But today, our food sources no longer contain the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients our bodies need to stay healthy and strong. That's why we need Primal Edge Daily Nutrition. It includes a special blend of ionic, soil-based vitamins, minerals, fatty, and amino acids in an easy-to-use liquid form. Primal Edge is powered by highly concentrated fulvic and humic acids, nature's preferred delivery system. They have been called miracle molecules because, like sunlight, air, and water, life cannot exist without them. That's right, Paige. They ensure we receive all the nutrition we need to be healthy and thrive. We, we take, take it, it every, every morning. morning. Primal Edge, formulated and approved by Nico and Paige of Living a Primal Lifestyle. Buy it today for just $89. Click on the Primal Edge banner on the front page of TFNN.com.
We take your phone calls now. now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-445-1044. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow right now uh, is up 65. You get the NASDAQ up uh, 25. S&Ps are up 9. And uh, that's kind of interesting. Let's see what's going on in the Dow because, uh, you know, it's not that it's a lot of points, but being right next to the, uh, it was at 349, just gave up almost three half. Foot, where it had a high of three, eight, uh, 349. Yeah, 18,349. Okay. So if we look inside the Dow, uh, the strength versus the weakness out here this morning, uh, the strength is DuPont, that's up 2.3%. Nike's up 2.2%. Goldman's up 1.2%, rather, 2%. JP Morgan's up 1.3%. The Laggett uh, is Boeing down 1.1%. Verizon, 6 tenths, so nothing heavy. Walmart, 6 tenths, and uh, Home Depot, 4 tenths. Uh, inside the NDX100, what we have is... Seagate Technologies up. Uh, they release earnings or something. Twenty percent. So check this out. This is pretty. What Seagate did, folks, is this. This has been a dog, and they just let go. I think seventeen percent of their help. <laughs> okay, they're cutting that costs. Yeah. Enormous. They cut, cut. They cut six thousand five hundred jobs. Okay. Um, and you'll see this this downdraft. This is a pretty amazing downdraft that it's been in. <laughs> Ooh. I know. So we've gone from sixty nine dollars. That was in December of 2014, down to 18. Okay. This, this is quite a pop, though. That's has got up over 50% from its lows. So. Yeah, yeah. And uh, the, let's see, so reducing for 14% of its jobs. Pretty heavy, man. That's, that's a big number. They must be, you know, that, that, that business is always so volatile. Hey, what's going on with that? Did you? The, the, Pokemon Go? Yeah. I knew you were going to see it. What? I really don't know. Okay. I did two nights ago out of curiosity download the app. Okay. And I haven't had the, the time or really okay. interest yet to right. go in there and right. figure out what's going on. Right. But um, yeah, Nintendo stock going crazy in Tokyo, right? right? And everyone on it. And I guess yeah. it has to do basically with it's the GPS enabled. And so you actually go to like real places to pick up things within yeah. the game. Right. So it's right. incorporating, which is a cool idea. Um, but I haven't played it. But I, I did download it, interestingly enough. And something, I, I read something, it might be already surpassed at this point, that it's on more phones than the Twitter app in a weekend. Yeah, right. That's amazing. Uh, it's, it's a mind blower. <laughs> well, then what's, what's Twitter worth, though, if, if you can make an app and have your app on more mobile devices than Twitter is over the course of a three-day period? I put, know. Put that in perspective, right? I mean, I, seriously. No, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's... Whatever what it, whatever that deal is, it's going to be a monster, evidently. Well, it is in a the same respect too. You hear the stories too, where people are like luring other people oh, into yeah, like a bad. parking lot or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah so right. be careful if you're right. playing it. For exactly. sure. Exactly. Exactly. Dave White will have to give us an update. I, I know he he downloaded it yesterday. I saw him in there downloaded. It. I think I saw him running around Clearwater. Maybe he'll have something in his tech insider. <laughs> <laughs> Look at he's laughing. <laughs> 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 oh my God! We got a caller. Oh, cool. Let's go for it. Let's go to Ken in Kansas. Hey, Ken, what's going on? Hey, how you doing, you guys? Good morning, Ken. Great man. Yourself? Good to talk to you. You too. T Tom, you must be very proud of Tommy following in your footsteps and doing such a great job. I'll tell you, <laughs> it was amazing watching it. Thanks, and, Ken. And yes, I am, and it was fabulous. I was watching him and Basil, and then him. Just yeah, it was yeah, he, the the, com the command was great. It was I loved it. It was it he was done huge. a fantastic job last uh, week. I know, man. Well, I get a good teacher too, and I, and we got but, good people around TFNN. Yeah, you know, all that makes it easy too. I, doing I the show with Basil, doing the show with you. did a fabulous job. Thanks, I mean, really, that's, really that's, great. That's very true. Your whole group is wonderful. Yeah. Well, thanks for the compliment. We appreciate it, man. Guys, I have a I have an option on SLV uh, August twelfth. Yeah. And I heard you say this morning that you thought silver was going to go down. Yeah. Uh, what do you think I should do about this option? It's up a little bit. I'd sell it. <laughs> so this is, you know, th now this is a hard call for me, um, you know, because the bottom line is that, you know, on a longer term basis, I like the metal market. I don't think that free money is going to stop, not free money exaggeration, but, you know, but I think that we have a problem here. And, yeah. and, the, and the large problem is silver. It, and what's happening right now, folks, is that 
it won't back off, you know? And so it's like, wow, man, this is getting really interesting. Cause, you want to pull it up? Just yeah, so like even this morning, right? The, the silver market itself, so gold's down 11 bucks, okay? But that's not a big deal. You know, when you, when you, I just gotta pull up gold first because I you just, just show both of them, okay? So gold's backing off this morning, you know, and it's going down and it's trying to test this, you know, the low of last Friday. It's getting close to it. I suspect it's gonna get it because the bond market got up this morning. So we got to 1341, 1336 is that low, right? Right. When you go over to silver, you know, silver just won't back off. Now, what I've found in the marketplace is this, is that when you get it, when you have an extension, I, you, let's just say that my, my take is that yes, it wants to go down because the extension has been so large, right? And then when something won't roll over, those are, those are always tough trades but when they roll, if I'm right, they roll dramatically, not in a small way, okay? You know, but it hasn't happened yet. It, it just hasn't happened. I mean, and, and when you look at, uh, let, let's go to, if we go to PAAS, you know, like this morning, I would just look at, at, a, at a couple of the, you Pan know. American silver, right? Pan American right. silver. Yeah. And, you know, that's not backing off, man. That just came down a little and is rejecting lower price. You know, so to answer your question, I would sell it. That's okay. that's the and, and the reason I'm I'm at that point is that the expansion up has been dramatic. The silver stocks that we had, we sold some of them two, three hundred percent profits. The right. extension is yeah. out there, so you're when I look at the probability wise, that's how I feel. And 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 bottom line is that I sold them too. I mean, so yeah. that's I yeah. sold you know, what I have. You know what I mean? So you can kind of take it from there. Do you know what I mean? There you go. Um, uh, so, and you know what happens is that when you get uh, here, all the, uh, and now this is this is the real kicker, folks. Let, let me bring this up. So I want to show you something. Okay, so I can do the silver. I'm gonna do. Let's see. We'll do a a, a strong stock A E M G G. I'll do G G. A lot of the equities. This is what's going on, also, folks. Is that a lot of the equities are coming into a huge supply line, and that supply line that we're coming into goes back to 2005. 11 years. Almost, 11 yeah. years. And that's pretty intense, man. You know, now we've come off the bottom. It's been a great move off the bottom, you know, if you happen to get them off the bottom. And we got pretty close to off the bottom. Yeah. But when you look at that supply line, if you're in your car, folks, we're looking at a supply line that's just a monster. So when I stopped putting that together, I said, you know what, man? People are just starting to get bullish in the, in the metals market. It's just deviant enough, you know. And, Listen, I don't know what's because when I when I look at the the broad market, I'm conflicted because in the broad market I think that the Dow is just going to top out and the, you know the market wants to pull back and if the market wants to pull back, you know the last pullback that we had in the market metals went higher, but that doesn't always happen. Yep. The, the, the pullback in 2007 metals got killed. Yep. So yep. it's a it's a probability play. That's the bottom line. Okay. Well, I thank you so much for the info, and you guys have a great week. Thanks, Thanks too, man. man. Have a good one. Have a great one, man. Have a safe one. This one's a tough one, man. Yeah. It's a, it's a tough one, you know. When we've gotten such enormous moves, whether we're looking at silver, gold, the market, oil, right. so many things, right. bonds, over and over and over. Right. You got to be worried about vicious moves up or down. Because right. Because I don't want to miss the next move up either. There you, go. <laughs> you know, that, that's, you go. that's the big thing, right? There you go. But guess what? I don't want to lose money. That's, That's important. That's the larger Capital thing. preservation. That's the larger Ooh. thing. Stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back. That's the larger thing. <laughs> Today, many commodities are trading at relative lows. And now you can take advantage with EverBank's new limited-time, five-year, market-safe currency comeback CD. This indexed and U.S. dollar-denominated CD offers 100% principal protection and is based on the equally rated performance of currencies of Australia, Canada, Chile, Mexico, and South Africa. These five countries are especially rich in commodities and the respective currencies are poised to do well should commodity prices begin to recover. Keep in mind that no APY or periodic rate of interest is paid on the CD. Don't miss out on this innovative new financial opportunity. CDs must be opened and funded by the upcoming July 14th deadline. To apply online and learn more about the CD, including product terms and disclosures, Visit everbank.com forward slash TFNN now. This advertisement is sponsored content 
Everbank is a member FDIC. If you're an active trader looking for that extra edge when it comes to trading and investments, then now is a great time to get a two-week free trial to Tom O'Brien's daily market letter, Market Insights. Tom O'Brien's daily newsletter, Market Insights, comes out every market day at around 9.30 a.m. and provides Tom's daily commentary on the broad market, including the Dow, NASDAQ, and S&P, plus specific trade recommendations. There's even an update published most afternoons to keep you informed about the day's market activity. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock and option trade. With Market Insights, there's nothing left to guessing. For all the details and to get your two-week free trial to Market Insights started today, visit TFNN.com. TFNN is excited to offer a brand new piece of market scanning software unlike anything the industry has ever seen. John Logan and his team have spent years developing their market profile tools to finally be able to release the TAS Profile Scanner Plus. And right now, you can get a two-week trial absolutely free just by visiting TFNN.com and providing us your name and email address. The TAS Profile Scanner Plus is the premier market profile-based scanner in the industry, powered by the acclaimed TAS proprietary algorithms, this feature-rich scanner is a standalone desktop software that instantly filters over 2,500 global financial markets such as stocks, ETFs, commodity futures, and Forex. Within three minutes of signing up, you can have the software downloaded and running on your computer with a complete roadmap of market indicators and inflection points to trade off using the TAS Profile Scanner Plus. Sign up today and try this amazing piece of software by visiting TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. The Dow right now is up 81. You get the NASDAQ up uh, 26. S&Ps are up 10.5. And uh, coming up this afternoon, folks, at 4.15, we're going to have our man, Mr. Chris Gaffney, uh, the president of um, Everbank World Markets. World Markets. We're going to be we're talking about the uh, currency comeback CD. I'm sure, among a few other things going on in the market, yeah. right, as well. Big time. Um, so last week we were talking about this. Basil and I were talking about it. Um, I even tell you, I talked to my friends, talked to the TFN employees. Yeah. I was talking um, just about the benefits of this. So Everbank with the currency comeback CD. Now this funding deadline is Thursday, the 14th. So today's the 12th. Okay. So if you want to take advantage of it, if you're out there, this would be a good time in the next couple of days. And you're having Chris Gaffney on tonight at 4.15 right. on your show. Um, so what it does is it's five currencies and they're in commodity-based currencies. Countries. Um, countries, yeah. thank you. Right. Um, so you have the Australian dollar, the Canadian dollar, the Chilean peso, the Mexican peso, and the South African rand. And I believe, we'll pull this up, yeah, you have an unlimited upside potential in this one, yes. which is pretty cool. Right. Um, and $1,500 to open, IRA eligible, and the best part is your principal's protected. You know, right. Worst case, your opportunity cost is what you could get in, you know, a CD market. In a CD right now. Yeah. Right. And CDs right now... Not paying In much. this interest rate environment, right. that's what I mean. The the <laughs> TFN employee I was talking to, he, you right. know, we were just doing something else, and he said, "Would you, you know, go in one of those?" And I said, "In like a heartbeat," because right. he's thinking about it. Right. And he said, "Yeah, I'm getting," and I think he said like 1.3 percent right now, or right. something like that. Right. You know, and that's you know. Right. So um, I'll be listening. He'll be on at 4:15 today. Yeah. But if people are interested, give them a call 855-750-4051, or just visit um, tfn.com. Click right on the banner, right. and um, you can and, give and them a, a call. It's a five-year commitment. Folks. Yes, that is the one thing that right. you know. If you could call it a downside, that you know you're 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 locked in for five years. But, but CD people like that. That's what it, that's, exactly. That's, that's, that's what a CD the person does. It's, right. You know, they exactly. just turn over CDs, yeah. Yeah. which is which is great. You wouldn't exactly be selling Amazon stock, right? And, no. You know, but yeah, if you have any money in a CD like investment then that's, that's an opportunity that I think I would take advantage of. It is. It is. And, you know, just when we were talking to Kevin, uh, it's going to be so hard that when you hear that the Dow's at all, or the, the S&P's at all-time house, the Dow's right next to it, and then there's people going to get be getting their statements say, well, why am I 
I don't, why am, why isn't my statement at an all time high? Oh, right. You know? Yeah. And it's, and it's because the, the NASDAQ is off its high pretty good. The, the, Russell's off the tie pretty good. Yeah. I mean, you know. Yes, for sure. So if you're if you're in the spy, if, the, yeah. then you know if that's all you own, that's a different ball game. Yeah, you know. And then, you know, so fifteen hundred dollar minimum on that, and the funding deadline's Thursday. And I was going to say we talk about them, and maybe they'll have another one that will be like another six, eight weeks out. But the best part is fifteen hundred dollar minimum, right. where I would be doing a few of them, you know, and right. just have my if you have CD money. That's, that's right. It's a no, great no, way to they, do it. Exactly. It exactly. You ladder them. That's, yeah. That's the la the la the laddering aspect on uh, that way. You know, ones. they just had a gold one. You have a currency one. Right. Um, that would be really cool. Where you're kind of diversified for upside. Oh, there, there's there's with, no with the, no downside to your yeah. principal. And there's no doubt the the folks that got uh, at least for the first it was the last one or the one before that. Both of them on there's gold. Some they did, done really they well did two there. in a row. Yeah. You know, they, and what happens with the current with the metal ones, they'll reset themselves every year. Yes, they have yearly know? pricing on those. This one, the currency comeback CD. It's a big one. I, no. I, I, I believe it's not yearly pricing. That's I know, it's, it's, you I know. You take the beginning, you cool. take the five years out, right. and you have unlim unlimited upside potential. Right, so you gotta uh, yeah. be, would you wanna be there, folks, uh, you know, looking at that, you, you're, if you're commodity bull, you definitely want it. Yes. You know, we can those see. Those currencies are gonna do well as the commodities of those countries exactly. do well. Exactly. Yeah. So, you know, market-wise out here, you're, you get the Dow up 83. It's got a little more room to uh, get up the, the, into that uh, 351 area. Can we take a look at uh, world rates just because the bonds are, yeah, they have get, some decent they get downsides? Slammed, so, yeah. so for, for a change, right, yes. we, we have yields actually on the rise. Right. I mean, look at the, the 10 years at almost 1.5. Um, yeah. You know, and you know what's so crazy about that? That's like, oh, it's almost at 1.5. Like, know. that's a lot. <laughs> Perspective and that, is everything. It, it is, because that's because it was almost at 1.3. It was 1.3 something. Um, yeah, 1.358. I mean, that's the oh, lowest. Oh, thank you. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Uh, so the, the range, this is cool. These ranges are cool. So the yeah, range for the I'm years, always looking at those. Yeah. Should, yeah. 1.358 was the low for the year. 1.927 uh, was the This is high. the last three months that you're looking at. Oh, is that all? That's, see, Ooh, they, let's put up a year. Can we do that? Sure. Yeah. Oh man, that's intense. Yeah. So check this out, folks. The range, that's amazing. The range for the 10 year this year is at 1.35 to 2.45. Yeah. So we're a full point below the high in the last 12 months. So that just goes to show that the 10 year definitely can go to 1%. Man, that's. Big moves, big moves. Yeah, that's pretty intense. Yeah. The, uh, in Canada, we're, we're at 1%. Now you still, when you go overseas, man, you're at France is it, is it what? Uh, yeah, point two basically. Yeah, of one percent. Germany is negative. Yep. Um, Spain is at one point one. Portugal's at three. Portugal won the World Cup, right? I mean the, the Europeans. Yes, they yeah, did. Big deal. Yeah. Um, Switzerland, of course, is <laughs> that's a, a half a percent, minus a half a yes. percent. Japan's at minus a quarter percent. Yep. That's on the 10. If we go to the five, this is where, so this is a correlation, which is pretty intense. The five, uh, we're at 1%. Canada's at a half a percent. United Kingdom's at four tenths of 1%. France is minus four tenths of 1%. Look at that. So if we were in, this is where this money's flowing in the US too. If, if we were in France or Germany, and we just talked about this CD right here, right? Yeah. You have to pay them. Right. You're paying a half a percent or four tenths of one percent yeah. to have someone hold your money. Yeah. What a great world that is. <laughs> <laughs> right? Isn't yeah, that crazy? I agree. I know. And in and, and Switzerland, folks, it's a full percent. I don't even want to, I, I can't. But the other side of that, right? You have to think about it. What if you're the guy collecting all that money, though? What are you going to do to make money on all that money to pay out? high percentages yes no that no, becomes I, tough too you know I, I mean that's just what that's the other side of, of I, that if you know and, and of it, course it, banks can do it real well and you can still do it real well but when you think about that it's like okay you know I mean just no you know they're, that's they're, it's a tough it's a tough environment maybe to, to do that if no, no, I, if it wasn't let's put it if it wasn't then it would probably rates would naturally be rising as everybody if the money was so easy there, there's no doubt there is more the e, e, and you know you hear folks on a continual basis that money is hard to get in the United States. Well, if you do the paperwork, it's not hard to get. It's 
you know, not real easy, but it's pretty easy to get. And it has to do that there's more money than there is things to put money to work for. Sure. And so that's why the, the rates are, are low, you know. Now, our rates are still higher than the rates that we look at. I mean, large companies can get that rate. Right, I can't right, get that right, rate. No, do you know course, what I mean? Of course, yeah. But what does but happen... But every rate's based off that. So but that's but the, rates yeah. that, the, the rates that we are getting, right, even in the real estate fund, are much less expensive, I mean, by almost like 50 to 80 percent than most people are getting on all these online lending and all that. Because it, okay. it's like, a, it, it's, it's, it's just intriguing. It's There's like... spread there, right? Huge spread. Yeah. Yeah, huge spread, you know. You stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. We're going to be right back, folks. Has the current market volatility continue to stop you out of trades when the market spikes against you? Now is the perfect time to open up an account with Nadex. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a brand new, completely regulated Chicago-based exchange, and unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their completely free trading platform, which also features real-time charts and full customization capability. One of the advantages of trading with Nadex in volatile markets is that your risk is always capped and you have the ability of keeping your trades open even when the market spikes against you. Nadex is completely completely brand new with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com. Or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors. Tom O'Brien's weekly gold letter, The Gold Report, gives complete and concise coverage of the entire gold market. Inside, you'll get Tom's commentary on gold, the dollar, the rand, the bond, the XAU, the HUI, and detailed coverage of nearly 25 mining stocks. He'll give you the entry price, price target, and stock price of each stock trade. The Gold Report is a long-term newsletter where the focus is on building real wealth through the management of a successful portfolio of gold stocks. With a lifetime of knowledge and almost 12 years of writing his informative weekly newsletter, The Gold Report, Tom O'Brien can provide you with the important market information to help you make better trades in the gold market. Don't let the next bull run in gold pass you by. To get a month-long free trial to The Gold Report, an $85 value, visit the front page of TFNN.com today. David White's newsletter, The Technology Insider, is focused like a laser on finding the next big things in technology. If you had invested only $10,000 in Microsoft in 1986, you'd have been a millionaire by 2000. Disruptive technology like Microsoft's is the key to these massive long-term profits, and The Tech Insider is the vehicle from TFNN to capitalize on these opportunities. This is the go-to newsletter that identifies, monitors, and profits on mostly little-known cutting-edge companies with great long long term prospects. David's experience is as an inventor of Emmy winning animation products for TV and Hollywood that propelled a company public. Match that with 14 years as a full time trader and he's uniquely qualified to guide you through the light speed world of ever evolving high tech. If you're ready to ride the next big technology bull market for less than $40 per month, log on to TFNN.com and get your two week free trial to the Technology Insider. Get in on the ground floor of the next big thing today. This segment is brought to you by TFNN. Test drive all the newsletters for free at TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. So we have the uh, Dow right now up 80. You get the NASDAQ up 28. We got the uh, S&Ps up 10. Let's go to Marie in Erie, Pennsylvania. Hey, Marie, what's going on? Hey, not too much. Uh, did you have a nice trip? I did. I had a blast. A week off, it felt like uh, I was really on vacation too. <laughs> That's perfect. That's how it should be. <laughs> it was. It was great. And and it, I love taking the week of July fourth off too because it's just it's just different. It's you know a fun what I mean? week, yeah. Yeah, totally. Well, so, how patriotic can you be? You leave the country. 
<laughs> well, I, I know, but I had red, white, and blue on almost. Oh, there you go. I don't, I don't know if that's red, white, and blue. Orange, yellow, and green. But Yeah, orange, yellow, and green. I know. <laughs> Hey, the the way the waves were great. I, I I went to Costa Rica, folks, and it was amazing. It was it was really amazing. Hold nice beach, yeah. decompress, decompress, surfing those waves. Perfect. Yeah. So, what are we gonna look at today? Ah, uh, still water mining. Okay, let's take a look. So, still water, folks, uh, is a oh, back up. Try it again. SWC. SWC. So. Uh, this company uh, mines platinum, palladium. Uh, it happens to be uh, in Montana, which is pretty wild. The low for the year is uh, $4.99. The high is 13, um, 13, looks like, well, this would be interesting as it's today, it's 13.30. So do you own this? Yeah, I've been in it, and I was uh, wondering if it's topping out here temporarily. Yeah. Okay, so... 1284, it's taking that out. So, it's already... It did it on lighter volume, that's what worried me. Yeah, no, no, I know. Let me let me bring this back a little bit further, Marie. So, I, I, I believe you get the gold report. You know, we sold a lot of them. I kept a couple of them. And it, it has to do with folks, you know, things... When you, when you go up this fast and make this much bread, it's dangerous. It's dangerous to stay in. This one, I like it, though, Marie. I don't know. Uh, you know, it's already into, see, what happens is this. When you're, you're already into the bar from June 30th of 2015, the, the low of that is 11.57. The high is 14.75, so it's like, you know, that can get it to 14.75. Um, let me bring this back a little bit further. As I, I said when we were talking with Ken from Kansas, the larger problem is that we're coming into a, monster supply line, you know? Yeah. And, and then, well, look at this case. This is this is pretty intense. This supply line goes back to 1996. <laughs> so this is even more bizarre than the other ones. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, be careful. Wow. Yeah, yeah. It's, I, I, that's, I, I, that's like a nice little channel. It's at the is, up, the isn't up, that the crazy? Upper, and it's, right. up, it's approaching the upper trend it, line. It is. For sure. I, I'd take the money. I'd take the money. You know, you might be giving up maybe a point and a half, but for what you're probably up, you know how these things are volatile, you know what I mean? Um, the, the, the difference is the, what, what happens folks also inside, okay, so they're coming out with their numbers on uh, the 29th. What happens in the metal market, this is where the difference is quite a bit and use, having just equities, uh, let's say inside the Dow or the S&P, you see gap downs, but not a lot, right? But in the metals market, because metals trade all night long, I mean, if the metals are down, if, if platinum's down $50, this can open down a point and a half, you know? For sure. Are the Emory? Oh. Sorry about that, We must Marie. have lost her, but I think Sorry. she got it. Yeah. I think she heard it. Right. Yeah. You know, and that, that's, you know, that that's inside the metal market. It, it, is, it is more... Volatile on a continual basis. Oh, and it, yeah. has, it has to do with hey. No, and you say it right. I mean, yeah. It, you know, if you don't want to risk that huge gap down, right, or up, but you know, if yep. you don't want to keep that risk in play, which it is going to be when you're trading metal stocks, especially, you know, some of um, I don't want to call it like a small one, you know, but where yeah, it can jump. Yeah, a, it, a big number based on that metal. It, it can. Yeah. There's no doubt. 877-927-6648. The, uh... Let's take a... Oh, let's, perfect. We got another caller. We got Helen in Lago. Helen, what's going on? <laughs> I'm looking at this Tower Hill mining, and this this thing, I, I just, you know, I'm wondering what's driving it like this, Tom. Uh, I got out of it about a dollar, you know, and now it's up to a dollar thirty-two. Okay, let's take a look at it. So you got uh, International Tower Hill Mines. They... Acquire, explore uh, mines. They have a portfolio in Alaska, Nevada. Uh, the low is 18 cents. The high is 140. Let me just pull this up. I see exploration company all yeah. over the place. In there Nevada. you go. Zero investment. Sell it. <laughs> Zero okay. revenue. Oh, you don't buy it yeah. again. You have already bought it. No, I, I you know, uh, okay. This, and I, I, you know, 
it's not that I know who's running this right now, but these people were, were right beside us in two shows that we did uh -huh. years ago. Yeah. Um, and I remember interviewing the CEO. She's not going to be there now, but, um, you know, the, the zero revenue. I mean. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, but it, look at this volume on it yesterday too. Oh yeah, listen, it, it went. You know, uh, they, they they've spiked dramatically. Let me see. Just so to keep in mind too, that's three million shares at like a dollar stock. That's only three million dollars. The company is only worth like a hundred million. Right. That can be like almost anything to put it in perspective. Oh, it mm -hmm. can. No, it can. And in fact, so let, let's see what they're saying. Um, it doesn't even say... Seeking Alpha? No, there was nothing as of yesterday. There's, there's nothing even in there. That's even worse. I know. I can't find any news on it either, so I was wondering what... I would say that's even more suspect. Way. And I would, you know... Like, yeah, well, no there's, no, there's no doubt. What happens inside the mining business, right? And the, 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 not, not the mining business per se, getting the gold out of the ground and the silver, but in the trading of the mining stocks, right? There's some large players in here, and once they know that... You know, you can get action going. You know, you you get you get fifty million, right? So, oh, let's see if I can get this action going here right. this That's morning. That's what I mean. Three million dollars yeah. is not a lot, exactly. of, a lot of people. Let me throw some money up here. Let me see right. if I can get it going. Because what do you really risk if you try and run like a dollar stock <laughs> yeah. up twenty cents, right? Let's say you risk, right. you know, you put a million shares in at, right. at, a, at a buck. You risk a right. million dollars if it goes to zero. It's not going to go to zero even if your plan goes away. So right. then you you know, let's it drops twenty percent. You know, you risk two hundred grand. Well, it just went up thirty percent, so they would have made three hundred grand. Exactly. So that's and, and that's only a million dollars. How many people have a million dollars in their trading account? A lot, a lot. in this country. Yeah. All right. So and it's their yeah. business. Yeah. And there's there's people that specialize in these equities, Helen. I mean, there's and a few. It's all like there's a few information. That, what's the the right. deal with their lay of their land? Right. You know, and and, right. and will they ever have any revenue? Right. So. Okay. All right. Thanks so much, guys. Great talking to you. Yeah, you really just gotta be worried with any company that number one has no revenue, right? And then number two, like it's one thing if you don't have net income. It's another thing if you have no revenue. Right. Then all you're right. based off is just your story. Right. And I didn't even, when we were just talking to her, I remember these folks very well, but it's so long ago, I wouldn't want to give my opinion now of 10 years ago, you know, as to who was moving it. Because what happens with these Canadian stocks... That's good, because I'd want to ask you a lot of facts behind whatever you would want to say. It is, but what happens <laughs> so with, you, with, yeah, with no, the Canadian stocks, you know, well, they, just keep, of, they just keep raising money, and, you know, it's like... There's a lot of stocks, though. We'll see. Oh, I mean, there's, 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 there's a lot of stocks. To, stock, to there's be a lot certain of what... There's, there's a lot of mining stocks, That could stocks, have been another stock. Who knows? You know, there's, there's, but there's a lot of mining stocks. There's this a, happens. No, for pump. sure. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back. Dow right now is up 86. Do you get the Nasdaq up 30? S&Ps are up 11 and a half. And uh, we'll probably hit that high maybe later on today. Are China A shares hot or not? If you trade China A shares, now may be time to take a closer look. Trade CHAU or CHAD. Directions Daily CSI 300 China A share bull and bear ETFs. China A shares in either direction. Visit directioninvestments.com today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Hi, I'm Steve Rhodes, host of The Trader's Edge, heard daily at TFNN.com and author of Mastering Probability, a daily investment and trading newsletter service that I send out each morning by 8 a.m. My morning newsletter service covers exactly what the markets have been doing since last night's close, providing you with an edge on your trading day ahead. You get actionable trading ideas, including the exact entry, stop, and profit targets. Plus, I'll teach you the patterns and hidden market correlations that will make you a better trader. As a subscriber, you'll gain access to my 90-minute money management workshop, where I'll teach you the secrets that'll save your assets. The bottom line, I've got your back, including a 30-day money-back guarantee. See for yourself the type of analysis I provide each trading day by signing up for Mastering Probability today. 
With nothing to lose, this is an offer you should not pass on. Mastering Probability can be found under trading newsletters on the front page of TFNN.com. It's 2016 and TFNN has a brand new programming lineup to kick things off. Starting January 4th, Swim Lessons by Thinkorswim and TD Ameritrade will be airing five days a week at noon Eastern time. Join hosts Scott Connor, Kevin Hinks, and Cindy Faber as they host their daily options program live at noon five days a week with no commercials for the entire hour. Nico DeHaan and Paige Clark will be moving their program, Living a Primal Lifestyle, to twice a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays from 7 a.m. until 8 a.m. Eastern Time. Wake up with Nico and Paige and start your day off right. The Bull Bear Binary Option Hour by Nadex will now be live Mondays and Fridays at 10 a.m. Start and end the week with the three hosts, Tom O'Brien, Tommy O'Brien, and Daryl Martin as they break down the world of trading binary options and spreads. For all the details on the new 2016 programming lineup, visit the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN educating investors. Catch Basil Chapman as he uses his Chapman Wave methodology to call the markets. The Tiger Technician's Hour, next on TFNN. Welcome back, folks, and welcome to Amazon Prime Day, right? Prime Day, baby. It's July Prime 12th. Day. So We're both Prime members. We, we talk about it all the time. Right. Um, we just pulled up. Why don't you pull up Amazon stock and take a look? We, yeah. we were looking at it during the break, right? We were. Pretty cool action. And oh, so what you, what you had is that yesterday, folks, Amazon had overtaken Berkshire Hathaway on the market cap uh, by like uh, $2 billion. Yep. And today it lost it. Right around like three fifty-five. Yeah. Both are, yeah. So, yeah. And so today... Uh, it's, it, it lost it as of now. Yeah, as of now. What, what you pulled up is that we did make a new all-time high for Amazon. We did. And today. today is the day. Yeah. I know, you know, it's funny. Which is pretty cool. But, you know, I said, ah, Bezos isn't going to be happy down five bucks on Prime Day, but you did make a new all-time high. Right. I mean, so right. you, I guess you got to be happy with that. And, yeah, you know, we don't, we were talking about, we don't even know what it really is about except deals everywhere. Right. Which is, I mean, talk about speaking to, like, a consumer nation, Right. Oh, what is it? It's Prime Day. What is it? Just deals, sales everywhere. And what did I just say to you? Yeah, I'll probably buy something. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so I'll be scanning well, it. That's for sure. There, there's no doubt. I try well, to have a higher threshold to impulse buys now because, you know what, I'm on this site too much for, for spending money when I don't need to because I spend enough right. money on here anyway on things right. that I do need. Um, but there's well, just deals I, I need, everywhere, I need percentage cover, I need of a, claims. I, I need a cover for my phone. I know That's that. That's perfect stuff. Right. I, I ordered right. my cover for my phone um, right. from there as well. Right. That is, because guess what? They're probably a great price competitor, zero shipping, and yeah. it's here in a day or two, depending. Exactly. Or an hour or two, right? right. Depending. Yeah, right. So we'll see how it shakes out. And you know what's had, happened here is that Amazon's bringing a huge amount of business into Tampa. You know, they, they opened the, the yeah. one center, and it's getting bigger and bigger. So, yeah. distribution center. If so. your city's fortunate enough to have an Amazon distribution center, right? Yeah. I mean, that's, those are some steady jobs, I would, I would assume. Huge. Yeah. And then, of course, around being around that, you get quicker service. You know, that four-hour service and the... Yeah, and they're going to yeah. be probably testing more stuff near you. Yeah. In fact, you know, right. they're, they're probably... Everything's coming out, but yeah, the, you're going to get the cream of the crop because you have so many employees in, in a hub that they can op operate out of. So we'll see what the numbers, I think they announced the numbers last year and I'm just trying to go off memory, like shortly after the holiday maybe, or maybe okay. they were just in the next earnings release, but that it was a huge number just when they basically just created a day and said, we're just gonna have a ton of sales. I know they created um, a day. <laughs> you know, and their prime base is so enormous that I don't even think of it as like a selective sales event. It's not, and, right. you know, Guess what? If you don't have Prime, I bet you know somebody that has Prime. Oh, you'll get it yourself. Or today. you'll get it yourself, and that's part of the goal as well to get them entrenched hey. in their whole environment. I right. switch gears for a second. Go there's for a new. It. There's a new. Uh, last night, folks, uh, on AMC, uh, there's a new series AMC started last night, The Making of the Mob. Oh, cool. And it was really cool. It starts. It, it's about Al Capone starting, right? Nice. And I don't know if it's, I don't think it's propaganda, but it, it almost seems like it is. So they started Al Capone. And he was starting, when he was starting out, like he was an accountant, and he said that he always wanted to be good. And then in between being good, he killed someone when he was like 19, the first. And then he went back to being an accountant again. And then... It was a slow... It was. Uh, that, that's how they show it at the beginning, man. Yeah. But it's really good. I mean, it, it's... I if, watched if, the movie this weekend, Black Mass, 
Whitey uh, oh, yeah. Johnny Depp. Have you right. seen that one? I have. Yet? I that have. was pretty good. It was. And yeah. then actually, I watched last night. I had a DVR with 60 Minutes, which started off with a story they did in 2013 okay. about when he got app apprehended. So right. I just watched that too. Right. Cool stuff. Yeah. Black Mass. <laughs> he did some bad stuff. He did. He did. He did. Right. All under the protection of the FBI. Right in the open. <sighs> Not even in the open, under the protection. Pretty sweet. It's quite a gig if you can get it. It was a gig. <laughs> and, that came, and so the bottom line, folks, that came all out of the L Street bathhouse, too. That's where the whole thing is. And you know the, you know the story that... Oh. oh, it's the end of the show. Oh, oh that's, man. That's that, that, Oh, that's, that's that, quite a tease. That's wicked. They'll have to come back tomorrow. All right, we're going to remember okay, well, that. Okay, I'll tell you tomorrow. We're gonna that. I'm going to tell you how Johnny Conley got to be the head of the FBI mafia deal and the rest right. of it. Yeah. Stay have right there. Day. Basil's coming right day. up, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Since 1984, Basil Chapman has been using the Chapman Wave methodology to advise traders of his expert market opinion. While originally hand-drawing charts from the late 1970s into the 1980s, Basil noticed that prices under most circumstances virtually always had a certain number of legs to the upside before declining sharply. Later, Basil found that computer software, which included the standard market technical indicators, enhanced the degree of accuracy in calling price turns, as well as market trend calls. Thus was born the Chapman Wave Sequence. Using the Chapman Wave methodology along with other indicators, Basil Chapman advises his subscribers of his expert market opinion each market day with his opening call newsletter. Right now, you can get a two-week free trial to the opening call, Basil's daily trading newsletter, by visiting the front page of TFNN.com. Cancel at any time during that trial and pay absolutely nothing. Get your two-week free trial to Basil's newsletter, The Opening Call, today by visiting TFNN.com. This is TFNN.